How is a contraceptive implant removed? A contraceptive implant is a small flexible plastic rod which is the size of a matchstick. It's placed under the skin in your upper arm by a doctor or nurse and is unnoticeable once fitted into the arm. You can have the implant put in at any time during your menstrual cycle as long as you're not pregnant. The implant works for three years before it needs to be replaced. If you want to stop using it before this, a specially trained doctor or nurse can remove it at any time. You do not need to go back to the same doctor or nurse that fitted the implant if you want it removed. Some, but not all GPs or practice nurses are able to remove implants, so you'll need to check at your GP surgery. Alternatively, most sexual health clinics will be able to do this for you. It only takes a few minutes to remove an implant and the doctor or nurse will use a local anaesthetic. They will then make a tiny cut in your skin to gently pull the implant out. You won't need any stitches afterwards as the removal site will be covered with some sterile tape and the dressing, also known as steri strips or paper stitches. The dressing should be left on and kept clean and dry for a few days afterwards to reduce the risk of infection. Look out for signs of infection after the implant has been removed. These could include redness, pain, swelling, skin feeling hot to touch or a high temperature in which case speak to your GP, a pharmacist or a sexual health clinic for advice. As soon as the implant has been removed, you'll no longer be protected against pregnancy. If you'd still like to be protected against pregnancy, you will need to consider your contraceptive options. For more information on having your implant removed and on contraceptive options, speak to your GP or practice nurse or visit your nearest sexual health clinic.